Hello and welcome back to the Unboxers and today we have for you some awesome Willy Wonka Funko Pops! Woohoo! We have the complete collection here. Um, Willy Wonka and the Oompa Loompa are out of their box because we opened them in a previous video. So if you want to see them in greater detail, go ahead and check that out. But we couldn't leave them out because uh, we wanted to complete the set and they're definitely a major part of this set. So, we have six new ones to look at today, and um, one is a summer convention exclusive, which we were really afraid we weren't, able to, weren't going to be able to get that one, but we actually found it at Barnes & Noble, and we were super excited. Um, Miss Robin from Robin & Penny, um, she got that one, and she told um, that it was at Barnes & Noble, and we just so happened to find it there, too, so a big thank you to her for showing us that. And she showed off that awesome Violet Beauregard as well. So we have the complete collection here. And we are excited to get these out of the box. But first of all, if you'll let me in just a minute to tell you why this one is so special to me. Um, in first grade, I know it's hard to believe, but I used to be in first grade. And this is a long time ago when, um, when you took naps in first grade, when there was like toys in first grade. Um, so anyways, back, you know, after there was fire, of course, though, and anyway, but, um, so we brought towels to school, and, um, every day at, I guess, after lunch, lay out the towels, and, um, lay down, and actually had a rest time in first grade, and the teacher, probably one of the very first chapter books ever read to me, was, um, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, so this movie, uh, has a special place in my heart, a special place for my childhood, and um, I like this movie as well as the new one. Some some people um, have preferences. I like them both. Um, this is just one of the movies that we just love in our house. So, with enough rambling and reminiscing there, um, we're going to get into these. So we have, of course, the main character, Charlie Bucket. And he's got his golden ticket. We're gonna get him out of his box and show you a closer look at him. Um, we have Grandpa Joe, and look at his mustache. And he has the fizzy lifting drink in his hand, which is really cool, because that part um, was different than in the book. And then we have Veruca Salt with her golden egg. Uh-oh, Veruca seems to be missing an arm. Oh no! Hmm. I think we're gonna have to return her. Okay, and 3,000 years later. Yeah. <laughs> look! Veruca has both arms! It's a miracle, folks! It's a miracle! <laughs> well, we finally found, uh, we returned the other Veruca. And uh, we noticed she was missing an arm. I have no idea how she was holding that egg. It must have been glued to her other hand. Yeah. She was palming it like a basketball. But anyway, there she is. We finally found Veruca to complete our set. Um, she has both arms, so we're super excited about her. I think she is the my favorite brat of all yeah. times. <laughs> She's super duper bratty. Um, but anyway, so there's the whole set on the back. Now, Mr. Assistant was pointing out to me that on the back of um, Willy Wonka and Oompa Loompa, it just started out with those two. Mm -hmm. And then it's like, they were like, yeah, I gotta have the whole set. And now we got the whole set, which is awesome. All right, so that's Veruca. A quick peek at the um, Summer Convention exclusive, uh, Violet Beauregard. Wouldn't have her in any other form, man. Yeah. The blue face, that is one of my very favorite, mm -hmm. favorite memorable um, parts of the book and the movie. So cool. I don't know why I'm showing the back. It's basically the same. Oh, look at her on the side. I love that. I love that illustration. Okay. All right, next. Go ahead, Mr. Sister, pick up one. And guess what? Grandpa Three Joe. Three years later, somebody joined me. Here's Grandpa Joe. With the fizzy lifting. He, he's got fizzy lifting drink in his hand. Mm -hmm. Oh, you I'm doing the same thing. Oh, you stole fizzy lifting drink. We'll be able to see it better when we take him out of package. But something you were showing me, go ahead and pick up Augustus. Oh. Yes, you, they're like twinsies. They're almost identical if you're not looking <laughs> close enough. Grandpa does have gray hair. But there's Augustus with his bite out of his candy bar and it's all over his face. Um, he is super cool. And definitely a chocolate eater. Very cool, Augustus. And, <clears throat> and my TV. 
Mike TV, woohoo! And little Mike TV, which is really cool that he comes yeah. with that. Um, he wasn't any more expensive either. Mm -mm. Nope, and he comes with a little Mike TV, which is super awesome. He has a cool illustration on the side, same thing on the back. I don't know why we keep doing that. All right, so we're going to get these pops out of the box so you can see this awesome, complete collection all together. First time we've ever taken them all out of the box yeah. as well, so it'll be awesome for us. We'll be right back. All right, and there they are all out of their boxes, and they look awesome. This is probably one of our biggest sets. Yeah. The Friends, I mean the um, Big Goonies, Bang Theory, probably. oh Goonies, yeah, but this might be the biggest, I don't think, good. and um, we don't typically um, collect whole sets unless it is something super duper important to us like yeah. this. So here we go, so um, let's see, hmm, who are we going to start with? Let's go ahead and start over here with Baruka and then I'll let you do my TV over there. The egg. There we go, so there's the golden egg. Um, of course, it was um, squirrels and there's my stomach. Um, it, go, it was squirrels and nuts and the other one, right? Because this yeah, was uh, this is an adaptation from. This was not in the book, but she's got the golden the goose that lays gold eggs for Easter. And by the way, look at her um, freckles on the top of her nose. So cute! Oh my goodness, just like her. Can't you just see the sass coming out of her in her little shoes? All right, so there's Veruca. Go ahead with Mike TV next. He is so awesome. Oh, he's, hey, at least <laughs> this little TV person stayed up. So there's Mike TV, and he's got on his um, clothes like he wore, yep. too. Very cool. And um, I just love his character. He's got his cowboy hat on the back, which is really cool because yeah, that's, that's how he wore it. And he's got his little um, water guns or cat guns or whatever right there. Very cool. And I like how they, you know, made his eyebrow and his hair come over it. Very cool. I love the attention to detail of these. And he comes with Tiny Mike. Mike. Tiny Mike too. I think this is the smallest Funko Pop I've ever seen. <laughs> and it does have a little bit of trouble standing. Um, but look at his feet. But it's feet. still so detailed. I know. Look at it. It's got all the white. I mean, the white thing and the goggles, and still got his hair printed on there, and the buckle on the back, and the little line that goes down the suit. Very super cute. Awesome. I'm surprised they didn't come out with Grandpa and Charlie and Willy Wonka in those suits as well. Oh, they yeah. may in the future. All right, and then we have um, Baru. Um, no, um, we Violet. have Violet Beauregard. Oh, I forget her. Look, and she's a blueberry. So her face. I like that her face is is a little bit different than the shade of her um, clothes because that's how it was in the movie mm -hmm. too. And her hands are out. Her hair is done in the back just like Violet Beauregard and her little shoes. And we're going to go squeeze her so we can get some yeah. blueberry juice out of her. Very cute. Awesome. So glad to have her. That would be horrible if she was the only one missing, missing from yeah. our collection. All right, next. Augustus. Augustus Gloop. Augustus Gloop. The great big gritty nincompoop. Look at, ooh, look what's on his mouth. <laughs> He's got a mouthful of chocolate. He kind of does look like a mustache, though. Yeah. Um, like a really sloppy mustache. But there's his chocolate bar. It's got a bite out of it, so you know. What's on his tie? Can you tell? I guess it's just an, uh... I don't know. I don't know. It's super duper teeny tiny, and I'm sure it is authentic to the movie. Yeah. Whatever's on it. Um, the buttons. He's got the one button buttoned. Because he couldn't button it all the way. He's got the shorts on and the shoes with the socks. And the back of him as well. He's got the little thing on the back. Very cool, and the hair is just right. Got that mm -hmm. swoop swirl going just right. Very cool, Augustus. And then we have, uh, let's go ahead and do J Grandpa. We'll do Charlie last. So here's Grandpa and the fizzy lifting drink, and look, it's translucent. Does it say that and on it there? It says fizzy lifting drink. It even bottom. says fizzy lifting drink. You can probably read that better than I can on the camera because. So there's Grandpa, and look at his hairline. <laughs> I love that because that is so right. That is just how he was. <laughs> And uh, we love the um, songs from this movie as well. Look at his hair. They have the hair just like Grandpa Joe. Very cool. And he was the only grandparent that would get out of bed and, yeah. go, and go with Charlie. Love his mustache. All right, so there you go. And then we have Charlie Bucket and his golden ticket. He has a golden ticket. And it says golden ticket. What does it say at the top of it? Uh, winner. Winner. Golden ticket, I think. Very cool. He's got his golden ticket because he's going to go into the factory. And his hair looks just like Charlie. Very cool, just like the 
the uh, the first movie, Charlie, of right. course. Very cute. He he's simple, but you know, gotta have Charlie. And the um, the golden ticket makes it super awesome. All right, and then we previously showed those. I'll just give a quick view. There's Willy Wonka and um, the Oompa Loompa, which is the very first two that we got before the others came out. Don't you just love them? Okay, do you have a favorite from this set or? That's a really hard. It is hard. I'm not sure I could pick a favorite from this set. And I love all the songs from the set and everything too. I guess Willy Wonka. He is pretty awesome. He is very awesome. I like him. Um, yep, I have a hard time picking because the details on all of them are um, really cool. I love that little itty bitty Mike TV. <laughs> I think that is really cool. And the Oompa Loompa, the details on him, amazing. Um, all right, so thank you so much for watching. We're so glad we were able to finally complete this set. It was probably months and months later before we could find a Veruca with two arms. So beware in the stores. Make sure your Veruca has yeah. two arms. She was such a brat, they left off one of her arms. <laughs> All right, so thank you so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, tell a friend, and we will see you next time. I got a golden ticket. I got a golden ticket.